Welcome to Today in America. A nation's strength comes from its sense of community banding together to create a people place where they can live, work, and have fun or just play. The essence of this is found in the country, cities, towns, and counties. Let's take a closer look at a community that its citizens are proud to call home. Located just north of Orlando, the city of Longwood is one of Central Florida's most historic cities. Established in 1878, you'll recognize it by its nostalgic charm, its community pride, and its innovative spirit. City leaders call Longwood a small town with big ambition. The city of Longwood has a population of about 14,000. We have an elite health care system, we have low property taxes, we have an A-rated school system, and a very diverse business community. Because of that, Longwood is an excellent place to live, work, and play. Its innovative way of thinking was exemplified when the Longwood Elementary School was closed by the school board. The city saw an opportunity to lease the school and created a community recreation center. The Longwood Recreational Facility is a, an example of something negative that has turned positive. It now is home to our Girl Scouts and Boy Scouts meetings as well as our Senior Meals on Wheels programs. We also offer classes in art and dance and karate, and it's a vibrant hub to our city, very active every evening. From preserving the city's rich history to planning for its future, community involvement is a key component to Longwood's long-term success. The downtown historic district is the heart and soul of the city. The inside-outside house built in 1872, Christ Episcopal Church built in 1879, and the Bradley McIntyre House, built in 1885, are among its treasures. The Longwood Village Inn opened in 1882, a couple of years after the first railroad line from Sanford to Orlando was laid. I'm proud to be involved with the charitable aspects of our community. For example, the Christian Sharing Center is an organization that provides housing, food, and transportation to the families in our community that need them. The city's commitment to sustainability is evidenced by its green initiatives and its economic development efforts. Longwood's green building program is our effort to maximize water and energy conservation while providing leadership to the private sector in development. We've also moved toward providing financial incentives for energy efficiency projects and moved toward taking more advantage of the state's brownfield program. From improving its existing programs to establishing new ones, the city is committed to economic development and quality of life. We make every effort to enhance the quality of life to our residents, and we continue to offer many programs and activities for our community to enjoy. Now that Sunwell has been approved, it provides a great opportunity for economic revitalization. This is of critical importance to our community, and we are committed to its success. When complete, the commuter passenger rail system will provide 61 miles of service from DeLand to Point Siena. The Longwood Station will be located on Church Avenue, almost exactly where the original rail station stood. Church Avenue is filled with old tradition, like brick streets and old-fashioned light posts, which will now become part of a new era while keeping its historic flavor. Located in Longwood's historic district and serves as a link to the Sunrail Station, Ryder Park and employment centers. Church Avenue will draw people to Ryder Park, which will become a destination for activities and entertainment. Families enjoy a full range of activities at Candyland Park. Candyland Park features a multi-purpose field, playgrounds, pavilions, and even a skate park. It is also home to Longwood Babe Ruth Baseball. Candyland Park is our jewel of parks within our city. It's proud home of our Babe Ruth softball and baseball teams. There, our children exhibit good sportsmanlike conduct and become productive citizens within our community by learning life lessons on the fields. We also host many district competitions there, and we are proud to boast that our Babe Ruth teams have won on the district and state level. With Longwood's central location, it's a short drive to Florida's East Coast beaches and all of the amenities that Orlando has to offer. Whether they come for a day or they plan to stay, visitors are discovering why Longwood is one of America's hidden gems to live, to work, and to play.